Ustengrav is out by Morthal, which is where those assassins dragged me off to. And I'm not in the mood to jog all the way back. So, we'll head to Whiterun and then... Take a carriage from there. Myth? I'm over here. No, I know where you are. It's just you've never mentioned that those were assassins. Should I be worried? Oh, no, certainly not. I dealt with them, like I said. And once again we circle back to why does the mysterious myth Idros have assassins after him? Like I said at the time, they must have mistaken me for someone else. See, I would believe you, but I seem to recall you mentioning to that Orsimer. What was her name? Adlug? That your father was someone important. Did they mistake you for him? No. They would have no reason to know what he looks like beyond just Dunmer. Which... We're not exactly a small minority in Skyrim, as far as I've seen. You know... I've been thinking about the things that you've said so far. And a few things don't add up. For example... Oh, gods. What? What's that smell? Oh, you don't want to know. Evidently, the uh, White Run Guard has had some fun. Right. Anyway, uh, I'm sure the Foresters Guild is code for something that I'm not supposed to know about. Because nobody has an important father in a forestry guild unless they happen to live in Valenwood. And you're from Morrowind. And nobody would send assassins out after the son of some woodsman unless... It was in retaliation for something. Sira. And you remember Angrin, all right? The one who's helping me with the Eratino residence? He said something about an assassin coming to see Aventus, who, if rumor is to be believed... Wolf. Hear it. Come on, Zira. Right. None of that. What was this about... Angrinor. I think that wolf is coming back. I'm going to keep an eye out. Good. I can only keep an ear out. But, uh, Angrinor. He said something about an assassin coming to see Aventus, who was trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood, if rumors were to be believed. I'm not sure they should. And you just said you got dragged out to Morthal by assassins. I don't think you are Dark Brotherhood, but I do think they're the ones that came after you, and I assume it must have had something to do with... Stop. It has nothing to do with my father or our business. Aventus mistook me for one of them when I went to go see him, and sent me out to deal with the old lady in Riften who runs the orphanage, or ran the orphanage. Myth. She was awful. I assure you, she deserved it. But you don't just kill people, Myth. That's something you should have brought to the guards. Not where I come from. Call it a cultural difference. Some cultural difference. Whatever you call it, the Dark Brotherhood got angry that I stole their kill. So they dragged me out to Morthal in the strangest attempt at a job interview I've ever been through. They were going to give you a job. Or dispose of me. I'm not sure which. The leader herself did it. I suspect any remaining Brotherhood are now scattered to the winds, or... Well, 
fighting amongst themselves. You took out the Dark Brotherhood by yourself. Well, of course not. I had a rather formidable wilderness expert with me. I paid her half of what the Penitus Oculatus gave me and got her a new bow while I was at it. Her? What? Oh, right, your guide. Well, that makes me feel better about some things and worse about others. Enlighten me. You're strong enough to take out the entire Dark Brotherhood on your own. Oh, what the... What happened? You know, I'm not entirely sure. I'm also not sure I want to know. Right, well... Uh, you're strong enough to take out an organized group of assassins. On your own, mostly. You're strong enough to take down an organized group of assassins and have so little regard for life that you killed an old woman. Sira. Well, you did. That doesn't mean I have no regard for life. Just no regard for hers in particular. I did save yours, didn't I? You're a very strange man, Mythidros. In the future, could you please not lie to me about what you've been doing? I think I'd have a hard time doing that now. I underestimated your intelligence. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm used to it. Having lived with my brother's shadow my whole life, I'm very much not used to being the smart one. What are you used to, then? Being the unruly, unfocused, and generally irresponsible one. And now you're responsible for dealing with the dragons. Go figure. Oriel could not have possibly chosen a worse person for that job. Oh yes, he could have. He could have chosen me. I suppose. But you're here anyway. In some ways, maybe he did. My Azura. <laughs> right. Are we near Whiterun, by the way? I hear a lot of... People and farm noises. Chickens. Horses. We are, in fact, outside the gates. Nice weather for a ride. Hope it lasts. I found the cart, then. What do you call someone that drives a cart? I don't know, actually. Hello. Careful. Need a ride? We do. Where do you want to go? Morthal. Climb and back, and we'll be off. <laughs> you sound particularly displeased about that one. Oh, you'll see why. Oh. You know what I mean. Couldn't ask for better weather. Well, you're not missing much. I'm not. Besides the cold. No, it's particularly foggy today. Great. Oh, that sounds... Uh, like I need to stay on the path. Where are we going? How do we get there from here? Well... That's a good question. I will tell you that Morthal is mostly a bog, so we might be waiting a bit. Great! I... that... It, there are so many sounds that I'm hearing. I'm not surprised. Great. Oh, horse! Uh, 
Oh, that's sick. Did I just lose the- no, I didn't. No, the people of Morthal just seem to not have much regard for trying to fight back the swamp. Ah. I suppose that makes sense. Stay on some kind of path. Oh, I found a thing. Hey, the fog is gone. Oh, good. However, the sun is also setting, so... It is still a bit dismal. Ugh. Ew. What did I just touch? It feels sticky. Um... I'm not sure you ought to know. Oh, good. It's blood, isn't it? Why does that surprise me? It really shouldn't. No, it, it shouldn't. Okay. I'd stop. Uh-huh. Why? Well, there is a trail of blood. And it's leading into a cave. I recommend not going that way. I like that recommendation. Which means we're just going to be off into the... Wherever we're going. Uh, I found some sun. Feels nice. Go... Sort of... Follow the sun. Alright. I can do... At least for the moment while it's still up. Tree. And you'll tell me when to stop following the sun, right? Frog. Yes, you'll want to turn left about here. Oh, there's a stump here. Right, left. Oh, frog. This is deeply unpleasant, but also somewhat pleasant. Because it's kind of squishy and cold underfoot. Oh, I found a path. I'm going to follow it. Given that that probably goes over mostly dry land, I think that's a good idea. Wait. Uh-huh, waiting. There are a couple of Nordic ruins nearby. At least I think they're Nordic. One of them might be Ustengrav. Okay. We'll go to the one directly in front of us. Do we need weapons? Probably. Right. Okay. Uh, oh. Company. Uh-huh. Oh, I hear you. I'll show you a real fight. Oh. Mage. Okay. Uh. You must die. Oh, thank you. Got him. Okay. Well, that was... something. It certainly was. Frogs. Okay. I found some sun, and I found... a hole. Okay, this is going to be fun to navigate. Is there a way down this hole? There is. There's actually a stairway. Hang on, there's a camp here. Uh, where? Right in front of you. You know, one of these days I'm going to just... Hello? 
assumes that when you say there's a thing, it is in fact right in front of me. Is there anything important around here? It doesn't look like it. Alright, on we go. Just give me a moment because the sun is very nice. Okay. You know, it occurs to me I probably shouldn't stare directly at it because... I mean, I don't know if that can further damage my eyes or if it even matters at this point. Anyway. We're in the hole. There's a door. There's a chest and a bandit. So there is. Smelly dead bandit. Oh. What? Oh. Very... Uh... Frogs. Okay, right. We're just going to go in. Do you want to practice with that stick of yours? I mean, I could. I'm sort of trying to save it for dragons. You may want to, um... You may want to practice with it now. Just so that you know how long the reach is. You know, that is actually a good qu a good point. Alright. There's someone mining down here. Also, holding the stick out like this means I can sort of feel things easier. Company already. Uh-huh. Where? Ah, there. Did we get them? We got them. I took a spike to the everything. Well, that went well. What were they mining? Rubble, mostly. Great. All right. Aha! There is a way in. I would keep my hand on the. What was that? What did I just? Ha, found you. I stepped on someone. I've got this. You think you step? No! Alright. Here we go. Are you keeping up? I am. I'm just covered in blood and trying to be stealthy about things. Right. Great. <laughs> uh... Where are we going? Somewhere. I'm just going to... I should keep my hat. Hello. I can smell potions. Sort of. That's a book. Where do I get the feeling I've gotten turned around? Well, you sort of have. 
Okay. a passage to your right. Okay. Oh, I, I see. It feels like not a place where you would want to try to be swinging a very large sword around. What are you? Oh! Well, that's interesting. What have we found? A tunnel of some sort. Okay. There's a chest in front of you. Hello? Right. Okay, we continue. Back the way we came, I think. Finding mistress, mysterious uh, secret doors. Indeed. What are we looking for again in here? Um, a horn. Well, there are plenty of those. They're all just holding torches right at the moment. Candles, rather. Sources of light of some description. Exactly. Hello. We're in a bit more of an open area now if you'd like to swing around the big stick. Maybe? Well. Oh, sorry. Well. Did you get them? You keep asking that when they're all dead. <laughs> you know, that's a good point. I probably should just... ...assume that the answer is yes. And I should probably also keep the shouts to myself, given... Uh, ...that I keep staggering you by accident. It is rather impressive, I'll say that. Thank you, I think. I feel like it's probably also... Uh, I, I don't know what the word is that I'm looking for. Bones? Right. In we go. Sounds biggish. Oh, it's biggish. There's a massive cavern through this uh, wall of vines here. Right. Noted. Do I... Yeah, I've already got the mace out, I might as well just keep using it. There's plenty of space. Alright, I will practice. Hello? Nice. Alright. Where are we going? That's a dead end. Okay, we turn, we turn, we turn. Careful. Of what? Uh, some sort of trap. I'm not sure what, what kind. Great! Uh... I'll do. Don't worry about me. There's a little fire, I'm a dunmer, I can take it. 
So what you're saying is I need to learn how to breathe fire so that I don't stagger you. Oh, hello. I think I hit the wall. So we do this. There's a magic one. Sort of aim up a little bit. All right. Did I get him? You got him. Do it again. Uh, I can't. I need to warm up a bit. Or rather, get my voice back a bit. I'm sort of losing my voice doing that, actually. Where are we? Oh, I hear fighting. Nice. <laughs> I found a passage. So that does actually hurt your throat to do that? A little bit. It's, uh, it's mostly just drying me out. That's fine. Have we just gone in a circle? We have just gone in a circle. Okay, so we go back this way. This pole. There's those tables. There's a bench. There's... New passage. Lots and lots of lit candles for some reason. You know... That's an interesting observation. Maybe someone was in here before us. Maybe? Although, I am sort of wondering why there are an egregious number of walking dead in here. They may well be tomb guardians of a sort. Sort of like the guardians of ancestral Dunmer tombs. Aha. Uh -huh. Uh, that's a thing that I don't know anything about. Oh, you know, bone spirits and whatnot. Sure. What is this doing? Opening and lowering a gate. This one? No, there's one in after it. Alright. Hang on. Can I reach that? Well... I don't really... Sometimes I have... ideas. I figured there might be one of those, like, off chains. Oh, is that a black soul gem? Uh, maybe? What do you need a black soul gem for? Uh, payment of that... That guide I told you about. What does she need a black soul gem for? I have no idea. I didn't bother to ask. Figured it wasn't my business. Hello. You've got room to swing in here. Alright. Well, looks like we didn't need it. Okay. Uh, and it's big, and I'm somewhat lost. I'm just going to keep going straight, I guess. Dead end. Okay. Turn around and just go straight. I almost ran off the edge. There's an edge here. <laughs> okay. 
We continue. There are a great many skeletons. Some of them have bows. Okay, where are they? I hear them, never mind. There's one. That'll do. What am I hearing? It sounds like a geyser. It is, in fact, a fire geyser. Okay. There's a body here. I hear more skeletons. Oh. No, don't worry, I'll handle them. Okay. There's more up top. You mean where the fire is? Actually, yes. Okay. Ouch. I'm less fire resistant than you are. Hello? I think we've got them. Good. Is that a chest? That's a chest. We found an enclosed space again. Back to the old trusty things I normally use. Okay. We are going somewhere. Is there a way down from here? It's not that far of a fall. Alright. Well, <laughs> perhaps I should have been using where are you? I'm finding my own way down. There you are. What was I going to say? Oh, uh... I should probably just be using this mace because it seems to absolutely obliterate skeletons. Good to know. That does actually make sense. Sounds like a waterfall. Something down here. Hello. It's another one of those strange walls. Oh, the ones with the dragon speech things on them. I wonder if I can actually read them now. If I touch it, I can feel the indents of the the carved letters. I guess they're letters. I still don't recognize the script, but I think that one was Fade? Fade, or something like that. Oh, water. There is, in fact, a waterfall here. Ah. Right. Where are we going? Um... I'm not sure. Great. Well, we came down that way. Go to your right. There's a ramp up. Ah, uh, and right again. I really should just stick to the walls, shouldn't I? Probably. How many of those are you going to pick up, anyway? What? They could be useful. That's fair. Well, there's not a lot up here. Hello? I thought I heard something. Oh, I hear water dripping. That's what that is. 
Where are we going? I guess back the way we... Okay. Focus. Water dripping in that direction, waterfall in that direction, which means, and light here. So the way back up is directly in front of me. That is correct, actually. Well, I'm getting better at this. Just follow the incline, and we will eventually... Find where we're going. Hopefully. What have we missed? I'm not sure. Oh, Myth, I think I've lost you. Here we are, sorry. There's a bridge directly in front of you. Ah. Skeleton up above. Okay. I hear you. Force! <laughs> that works. Any more of them? I don't see any. I hear... Was that the, just the one with clattering around? That is correct. Right. We want to go back down now. Because I think I found the way in. Oh! What have I done? Oh, I see. Well, this could be interesting. What? Well, there's... There are gates. At the end of... Directly in front of you. Okay. Oh... Uh, I think I know what I need to do. I... You know that thing that I was going to do that I never should do again? Which one? The sprinting one. I think I need to do that. Oh boy. Good luck. Try not to leave me behind. If there's a chain on the other end, I will pull it and we will see what happens. There we are. Hey, they stayed open. Okay, good to know. Oh, no, this is an enclosed space. We keep the mace. What's in here? More fire traps. Oh, great. Well, Is what we'll do. Ouch. Well, we got there. Where? What am I hearing? Spiders. Ah. Oh. Okay. They haven't attacked us yet. No, surprisingly. I'm a bit confused by that. Huh. Okay. What, do you have some affinity with spiders or something? Not that I'm aware of. Okay. <coughs> they sound absolute. sorry, absolutely hideous. But if we don't have to fight them, then so be it. 
There's a thing somewhere. Well, what's going on? That will be Nordic dragon pillars rising from a pool of water. That was interesting. Okay. So we just go? We just go. Right. What is that? Uh... You know, you can see, you might tell me. Well... I think... We found where Jürgen's horn is supposed to be. Oh, and instead there's this piece of paper. What does it say? Dragonborn. I need to speak with you urgently, or speak to you urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood and I'll meet you, a friend. Oh, that doesn't sound like a trap at all, does it? No, that sounds exactly like a trap. The good news is I don't think they're expecting two of us. Fair enough. Where is Riverwood? Somewhere around Whiterun. That's all I know. Fun? How did someone get in here to be able to... Huh. Uh... Where are we going? Door to your left. I should get my stick out. Hello. Well, that's interesting. Is that... It is. Ouch. Sorry. I think I'm going to keep that one on me. I'm getting better at the whole edge alignment thing, I think. I think so too. That is rather a massive mole. It, it does feel a bit top heavy, I'm not going to lie. It looks a little top heavy. Do I keep this, or do I go back to whatever I was using before? No, I think I keep this. It feels a bit strange, but I'll get used to it, I think. We've just found a whole tunnel. Indeed we have. Oh. What? Well, I think I know how somebody got down here before. We didn't go in this room. Ah. Okay. Oh, and it's full of urns. Where are we going? To your right, I think. Past all of the dead bodies. Oh, great. Thank you for reminding me that those are here. You're welcome. <laughs> uh... Just trying to remember what I sort of know about the layout of this place. Oh, there's air under this door, which means this must be out. All right.
right. Now we climb back out of the hole. And then figure out where Riverwood is. It feels like the sun has set. The sun has indeed set. The sunset is quite beautiful, actually. Twilight and Skyrim. <laughs> so... Do we want to set up camp in a swamp? Or do we just head back to Morthal and find an inn? You know... I'm not feeling like trusting people right now. Why not? Because we don't know who that friend is. That's a good point, actually. It could be somebody who wants one of us dead. Right? Correct. And I would put my bets on myself, but... We know that that note was addressed to you, so... Right. So we camp here. Oh, they've already made a fire for us. Okay. Sure, we will camp here. Hopefully the fire keeps out any... Who knows what might be lurking around. I'm a little scared, actually. You'll be fine, Sira. Don't get kidnapped this time. I won't. I will do my best, anyway. We don't have to worry about the Dark Brotherhood anymore, at least. True. 